army wants a light tank for infantry brigades that will be able to knock out bunkers and defeat enemy armored vehicles. Mobile Protected Firepower MPF, program the army's first new design vehicle fielded in more than four decades. MPF will also allow soldiers to move at a faster pace, protecting the assaulting force. Next Generation Combat Vehicle Program, intended to find replacements for the M2 Bradley Infantry Fighting Vehicle and the M113 Armored Personnel Carrier. The first unit should be equipped with the light tank in late 2025. Tier acquisition rapid prototyping phase, the Army successfully tested and evaluated 24 prototypes during a pandemic. Middle tier acquisition authorities allow the Army to have the flexibility to get prototypes into soldiers' hands quickly to enable fidelity on known risks and develop informed plans moving forward. The MPF will be the Army's first new design vehicle fielded in over four decades, with first unit equipped plan for late fiscal year 2025. During the low-rate initial production phase the Army will take delivery of MPF vehicles and conduct production qualification testing to include lethality, mobility, survivability, full-up system live fire, and reliability, availability and maintainability testing. Additionally, an initial operational test and evaluation will also be conducted, all leading to the first unit equipped. The award of subsequent low-rate initial production vehicle options will be based on review of cost, schedule and performance metrics defined in the acquisition program baseline. The MPF will be meant for bunker busting roles and combating light armor using a gun in the 105mm to 120mm range. The vehicle is meant to be easily air transportable and standard cargo aircraft like the C-17. General Dynamics Land Systems submitted an offering that puts a version of its latest Abrams turret together with a chassis that uses past work on the United Kingdom's Ajax based Escort program. The mobile protected firepower approach leverages both recently developed and battle-tested designs. The highly advanced and powerful combat vehicle is designed to strengthen the Army's infantry brigade combat teams. The MPF program is the first under the Army Futures Command cross-functional team for next-generation combat vehicle that fills a critical capability gap. Designed by General Dynamics Land Systems, the highly lethal, survivable and mobile direct fire combat vehicle melds recently developed and battle-tested designs to dominate ground threats on the multi-domain battlefield. The MPF vehicle employs a four-person crew and features an enhanced thermal viewer, a large caliber cannon, a lightweight Holland turret, and a modern diesel engine, transmission and suspension system. 
It has been designed from the start for capability upgrades, based on future operational needs. Land Systems is a business unit of General Dynamics NYSC, GD. General Dynamics Land Systems provides innovative design, engineering, technology, production and full life cycle support for land combat vehicles around the globe. The company's extensive experience, customer first focus and seasoned supply chain network provide unmatched capabilities to the US military and its allies. General Dynamics is a global aerospace and defense company that offers a broad portfolio of products and services in business aviation, ship construction and repair, land combat vehicles, weapons systems and munitions, and technology products and services.